bounce a kid's volleyball or the like onto the cross marked with tape on the floor and catch it again with both hands above waist height on the rebound without losing the ball. The ball must be caught with the palms of the hands at least five times in a row without a mistake and only one second may pass between the bounces. Dribble the ball between the boxes through the corridor of 2.8 by 9 meters from beginning to end. The child has to move forward continuously without touching the ball with their hands and without the ball ever touching the boxes or the side markers of the corridor. So they have to stay within the corridor the entire time while dribbling the ball. Stand behind a box of about a foot or 30 centimeters width and throw the ball at the target. You have six attempts in total. The target is placed at 1.1 meter height onto the wall, the lower edge. And then a line is marked 1.5 meters in front of the target. And the box is placed behind that line, so the shooting distance is the 1.5 meters plus the width of the box. To set up, two lines are marked with tape at 1.5 meters distance from each other for the students to stand behind. And these lines are also connected by a vertical line marked in the middle with a cross with tape for the ball to bounce. For orientation, also put a pole that is marked at the height of 1.1 meter and place it in the center of this vertical line. The coach then throws the basketball with arms fully stretched out onto the marking in the center of this vertical line so that the ball rebounds to about 1.1 meter. And the child tries to catch this ball after the bounce on the fly. <laughs> 